Welcome to Data Analysis. This is the most loved course, MBC 638. It's otherwise known as statistics. Um, you know there's learning objectives, you can read about those in the syllabus, but there's two things we're not going to do in this class. We aren't going to learn stats in a vacuum, and we're not going to focus on theory. So we're going to use this thing called DMAIC as our framework. We're, we're going to apply stats within that framework. And the techniques that we learn and cover will be methods that convert data into information so that you, as a business person, can make better informed decisions. We will spend time in five phases, defining, measuring, analyzing, improving, and controlling. So in the define phase, we're going to define your problem, your process, your data. That's descriptive statistics. We're going to measure. We're going to measure your process. We're going to measure and evaluate your measurement system. We're going to look to see, do you have measurement error? We're going to analyze. We're going to use some inf inferential statistic tools in that analyze phase. We're going to move to improve. We're going to fix your problem. We're going to discover y equals f of x. And we're going to use stats for kind of the direction in which we want to go. And we don't want to plan on eliminating any experiments. We're just going to give ourselves a direction with statistics. And then, of course, the last phase is controlling. We're going to use tools to help us focus on really what's important. So now, before we get started, I have three questions I'd like to ask you. OK, I'm a data geek, so I love to collect data. So, and I've been collecting this forever, all these questions, answers to these questions. First one, what do you do? What's your job, career, journey? Give me your 90-second elevator pitch about yourself. Second question, I want you to answer either yes or no. Have you taken a statistics course in less than or equal to 10 years? And the third question I want you to answer for me is tell me something unique about yourself. Maybe your hobby, or like you have 10 cats at home, you brew beer, you were married on top of, the, of Mount Everest, whatever it is. Um, and the reason I'm asking those three questions so I want to know, in our class, do we have a bunch of fi finance folks? Do we have people in manufacturing? What about marketing? Do we have anybody that's in PR? I want to get a sense of that to understand how different um, examples may work with that group. I also like to know your comfort level with statistics and math in general. So that's my reason for question two. And question three, I want to know something unique about you because that may, after you listen to everyone else's, um, pitch, um, you might find out that you may have common things and you have things in common with um, other people in the class, but it also might give you some ideas of what you could do a project on because you may or may not, everybody in this class is going to have to pick a problem, a project, and it may be appropriate to use something that you, um, you do at home or you do for fun. So now I'll answer those questions for you. My name is Leanne Martin. Um, I've been in industry for 20 years, 20 plus years, um, 15 of those at Xerox. I have a um, undergraduate degree in industrial engineering and my master's is in industrial statistics. So I know a little bit about everything and a lot about nothing. Um, I have manufacturing experience, but I also have, I've also been in marketing as well as distribution. So I have all kinds of good examples. I've been in corporate customer communications, PR, so I've got some good examples um, that we can use in this class that relate to those areas that you don't typically think um, would be you know, data driven or, or data rich. Um, I have experience online teaching, did it for a while for another organization for coming to Syracuse and I've been in uh, Syracuse now teaching for almost 10 years. And that's really what I love to do. And which leads me to my unique thing is that I coach figure skating. Love it. It's my passion. And um, I have some elite skaters. I've got some that um, actually are national dancers um, that have gone to Colorado Springs. And I think that's what I can bring to this course is take that, I can take a look at uh, the art and the science, get those two to, to blend and not necessarily collide. And that's what we'll, you'll notice with this course. We'll, we'll try to take that, the art of statistics, the science of statistics, and make it all make sense.